Tonight we have new information about the train trouble that may have held up your ride home on the commuter line or your drive through the Hanson area. Tonight, the company that operates the commuter rail says an electrical short in the locomotive cab caused the train to start smoking. As WBZ's Julie McDonald shows us, that train broke down in a very inconvenient place. A very, very frustrating end to Friday for commuter rail riders, not only on the affected train, but held up elsewhere along the Kingston line. I didn't care if I was going to walk. I wanted to get the heck off that train. As the Kingston line delays stretch longer, train passengers' patience grew thin Friday evening. Sky Eye was right over Hanson, where an electrical short caused some smoke at the front of this commuter rail train. It became disabled at the Main Street crossing, holding up drivers, these riders, and other trains waiting behind. I think it was in Abington that made an announcement that it was the... Uh, but, you know, disabled train up ahead in Halifax, no timetable. We'll keep you posted as much as possible. Hanson first responders safely controlled traffic nearby. Firefighters made sure there was no risk of flames due to that electrical failure. No one was hurt, but a lot of people were stuck sitting and waiting for hours. Especially being up 4.30, being a nurse in Boston, the last thing you want to do is sit and wait an hour on the train for it to move. And those fire crews had cleared out and reopened the Route 27 Main Street crossing area just before 7 o'clock. In Hanson, Julie McDonald, WBZ News.